misshapen moon in orbit. That's what controls the mark the state of these creatures, or rather, it would have been. You see, the natives of this planet constructed a machine that froze the moon in mid-formation. But it wasn't enough. Even half-formed, the moon's marker signal speaks to the markers back home. And it doesn't end there. There is a network of brethren moons spanning the stars. As each one completes, it connects to this network, making them aware. If this moon should complete, its brothers will all come, looking for food. But there is hope. The natives never finished configuring the machine. It wasn't meant to merely freeze the moon, it was meant to destroy it. You'll need the Codex. It is the key to unlocking this machine and reconfiguring it. Follow my trail into the heart of the machine and end this nightmare. Carver, did you hear that? The machine can crush the moon. It just needs to be properly configured. What about Danik? Stopping Danik won't be enough. We need to get that codex back. It's the key to reconfiguring the machine. But Serrano's locked the passage using some kind of alien glyphs. I'm gonna look for a way to bypass it. This must be ground zero. And that must be the machine. 
So I guess this is it, huh? Yeah. This is it. I need you to promise me something. If I don't make it, you'll get this done, right? We'll get this done, Carver. You and me. Yeah, but if I don't... I helped get us this far. And that's close enough for all this to count, right? Count for what? For... I don't know, just... All the bad I've done. Oh, shut up, Carver. You're a good man. I alienated my son. Wrecked my family. Isaac, I killed Santos. Is that what a good man does? Good men mean well. We just don't always end up doing well. <laughs> yeah. Hey. I'm sorry about Ellie, man. Me too. Me too. This way. Clear that rubble. Look, it's Danny. It's not too late. You want to turn it back now, right? Let's go get that codex. Come on! Yeah. I have these paths. They join up with Danix up ahead. Try to slow him down. I'll find another way. You have to stop. Isaac, is that you? You are unbelievably hard to kill. Are you aware of that? Danik, do you know about the moon? Do you know what it is? Part of the miraculous ecosystem, I assume. It's alive, Danik. It's hungry and it isn't alone. If you turn off the machine, you'll set it free. And then it and all its brothers find our markers, find us, and wipe us out. How can you presume to know its intentions? You fear it because you don't understand it. Danik, hear me out! Danik, are you listening to me? Motherfucker!
Isaac! He's getting away! Hang on! I've got a plan! Served as a cautionary tale to us all. What drove them to such extreme behavior?